Welcome back to Undertale. And last part we started the game. Defeated Napster Blue. Well, not defeated, but he just went away. Um, yeah, and now let's continue the game. That this leaf thing here is where Napster Blue was at. Let's continue. Did you miss it? Spider bag sail down and to the right. Come eat food made by spiders for spiders of spiders. Of spiders, they eating themselves? What the fuck? Okay. Robert, Robert. I heard using a fork can make you have a full screen. But what does a fork stand for? Four frogs? I've only seen a maximum of three frogs in this room. This is troubling to say the least. Uh, yeah, there's somewhere here. I think you can somewhere actually. Okay. Hello. I just realized that it has been a while since I've cleaned up. I was not expecting to have company so soon. There are probably a lot of things lying about here and there. You can pick them up, but do not carry more than you need. Someday you might see something you really like. You will want to leave room in your pockets, so for that. Uh, I want to show something, come on! Okay, Luke, that's a new um, opponent. Luke, attack 6, defense 6. Don't pick on him. Family name? I Walker. It makes sense. Please don't pick on me. I will pick on you. No, JK. Okay. Yeah, for this one, you just have to not pick on him. Finally, someone gets it. Yep, and now he's happy, and we can spare him, and cool, and all, and bam. Let's go. I want to talk with that. Um, yeah. I have you are quite merciful for a human. Surely you know by now a monster wears a yellow name when you can spare it. What do you think of that? Very helpful. It is rather helpful. Remember, sparing is just saying you won't fight. Maybe one day you will have to do it even if the name isn't yellow. <laughs> Foreshadowing. Okay. There's just one switch. Okay. Okay, okay. Oh, here we have many <laughs> correct things. Don't know. Who are you? Vegetoid came out of the earth. <laughs> Literally. Vegetoid, it takes 6 defense 6. Serving size, war monster. Not monitored by the USDA. Contains vitamin A. Yeah, vitamin A. Good for your eyes, right? That's what they say at least. Uh, dinner. You pet your stomach. Vegetoid offers a healthy meal. Eat the greens. Yeah, that's what we have to do. We have to eat the greens, actually. Then we can spare them. Pretty helpful, pretty simple, all fine. You will see every single one. What's that? You found a faded ribbon. Ah, that is indeed a defense item which we can use. You equip the ribbon. It has, I think, two defense or something. That's what we had by default, the bandage. We can throw that away because we do not need that anymore. And we can spare Miko Miko's balls gold already. La la la, just be yourself. And this guy just stands. He's a happy, happy guy. Great. Okay. Let's go down there. Hey, Napster Bluke. I fell down a hole. Now I can't get up. Go on without me. Wait. Those can fly, can't they? Oh, well. <laughs> this motherfucker just forgot he can fly. You're a ghost. Here's the switch we need. I think I didn't show you, but um, that was locked. Let's go down here first though. Nothing. And down there is just a batch toy, so we can just go on. First we have to do that again. Yeah, the first area of the game, I would say, has really easy opponents, so don't worry about them. The far door is not an exit, it simply marks a rotation in perspective. Okay, you can go right away. Hello, looks. Oops. I've picked the wrong button. Damn. That's fine. Yeah, so, as a matter of fact, the the attacks of the, of the enemies, of the monsters, are really easy so far. And it won't change for a while. If you can read this, press the blue switch. Yeah, you might think, where the fuck is the blue switch? Well, it is hidden right here. 
That's so mean, like... You can't see that, it's so mean. I mean, it doesn't matter. Since I do know the game. I did not, um... Hide that from you, though. If you can read this, press the red switch. Well, that's a rather easy one. Because it's right here. Come on, so many opponents. Two Lukes, what? Finally, well, don't get it. I think I won't, um, oops. Won't race around and just don't pick on them as well. Two Lukes are pretty hard, though, I gotta say. That's rather, um, challenging. I will eat a monster candy now, just in case. If you can read this, press the green switch. It is no green switch, but it's here, I think. No! Damn, that's unfortunate. We probably have to go for some fights now again. That's fine. Do, 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 do. The music is absolutely insanely good in this game, by the way. I think you I already know that. It's here, by the way. But the music is incredible, incredible in this game. Absolutely stunning. A pair of wedge toys. Okay, let's uh, dinner. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, two wedge toys are really hard. Holy damn. Come on, no. That was that was unfortunate. But I got this now. I got this now. Easy, easy. Queen. Let's go. Cool. We have two ways here. Let's go this way first. Hey. Ribbit, ribbit. Just between you and me, I saw Toriel come out of here just a little while ago. She was carrying some groceries. I didn't ask what they were for. We we're all too intimidated to talk to her. <laughs> She's not that intimidating. What's that? We found a toy knife. Yeah, actually, we do not need that because that's an attack item. And since we are playing pacifist, let's throw it away. Such a great game. Oh dear, that took longer than I thought it would. Uh, hey. Yeah, I'm here. How did you get here, my child? Are you hurt? There, there, I will heal you. I should not have left you alone for so long. It was irresponsible to try to surprise you like this. Well, I suppose I cannot hide it any longer. Come, small one. Yep, okay. That's save point. Seeing such a cute, tidy house in the ruins gives you determination. Okay, why does it give me determination, though? Do you smell that? Surprise! It is a butterscotch cinnamon pie. I thought we might celebrate the arrival. I want you to have a nice time living here. So I will hold off on snail pie for tonight. Here, I have another surprise for you. Snail pie? Damn, that's gross. But well, it's a goat, I think, so... Is that, is that normal for a goat to eat snails? I don't know. This is it. Oh, is she even a goat? What she even is she? A room of your own. I hope you like it. I don't know, I didn't even see that. Is something burning? I make yourself at home. That's our room. Cool. Look at these cool toys. They don't interest you at all. <laughs> Damn. An empty photo frame. It's really dusty. What's that? A box of kid shoes and a disparity of sizes. So many cute little things. No, we can't. Okay. Oh. Sleeping. Someone brought us a slice of butterscotch cinnamon pie. Toriel is so nice. Such a nice person. Oh. Is that Toriel's room? I just have such a big bed. It's Toriel's diary. Read the circle passage? Yes. Read the passage. Why did the skeleton want a friend? Because she was feeling boundly. The rest of the page is filled with jokes of a similar caliber. Oh my god, dude. Boneless. Room under renovations. Oh damn, that's sad. Yeah, that's us. It's you. Yeah, that's what I just said. It's me. 
Okay, let's go to tutorial. She should be here somewhere. Probably here. Oh. Hey. Up already, I see. Um, I want you to know how glad I am to have someone here. There's so many old books I want to share. I want to show you my favorite bug hunting spot. Okay. I've also prepared a curriculum for your education. This may come as a surprise to you, but I've always wanted to be a teacher. Actually, perhaps it isn't very surprising. Still, I am glad to have you living here. Oh, did you want something? What is it? Uh, when can I go home, though? What? This, this, this is your home now. Uh, would you like to hear about this book I am reading? It is called 72 Uses for Snails. How about it? Um, how to exit the runes? Um, how about an exciting snail fact? Did you know that snails have a chainsaw-like tongue called a radula? Interesting. How do we exit the runes? That is not my home. I have to do something. Stay here. Where are you going? Wait, let me check this room first. Arts kitchen. Can we just go with the whole pie? The size of the pie intimidates you too much for you to eat it. Oh, come on, dude. I eat such a slice of cake in two minutes. What do you mean intimidating? It's nothing. That's scary. Hi. You wish to know how to return home, do you not? Ahead of us lies the end of the ruins. A one-way exit to the rest of the underground. I'm going to destroy it. No one will ever be able to leave again. Hope you know be a good child and go upstairs. Nah, man. I want to exit the ruins. No matter what it takes. Every human that falls down here meets the same fate. I've seen it again and again. They come, they leave, they die. You naive child, if you leave the ruins, they, as gore, will kill you. I am only protecting you, do you not understand? Uh, do you understand? Go to your room. I mean, she has. She probably has a point, but like, we need to exit the rooms. Do not try to stop me. This is a final warning. I'm sorry, Tori. I have to do it. We want to leave so badly. You're just like the others. There's only one solution to this. Prove yourself. Prove to me you are strong enough to survive. Oh, trust me, I am strong enough. And there we go, the first real boss fight, I guess? It is Toriel, let's check. Toriel, take 80, defense 80. Knows best for you. Yeah, her attack plans are actually starting to... Like, this, this game is starting to get hard now. Wait, what? Toriel is acting aloof. Uh, let's talk then. You couldn't think of any conversation topics. What do you mean, dude? I can always think of something. Toriel looks through you. Okay, what we have to do, I can tell you, by the way, this music is insanely good. Uh, we have to mercy her the whole time. Why? Well, she will tell us, probably. Toriel is here. Yeah, I know. She's only using one attack the whole, the whole time. What's going on? Why is she only using one attack? Ah, okay, now it's something different. The flames things are oh, they're so hard to dodge. Toriel takes a deep breath. What are you doing? I oh, did I take a sword. That's like a little trick though. We have to stay in the mid. No, but... Attack or run away. Woo! Oh, that, that attack is hard. Holy fuck. A toriel prepares a, ma prepares a magical attack. What are you proving this way? Guys, I, mean, I might need to have to concentrate! I have 5 HP! Fight me on leave. Oh man, oh man, oh man, oh man, holy fuck. Stop it! No, I will not. What the fuck? Toriel is there. the same. Stop looking at me that way. He's looking to the right. She feels bad or some kind of feeling. Go away. She 
she's not really confident anymore in both herself and yeah she probably feels like that she she just wants to protect us really that's a thing oh wow the text go away I didn't want to go home but but please go upstairs now I promise I will take good care of you here. I know we do not have much, but we can have a good life here. Why are you making this so difficult? Please go upstairs. Oh man, she's sad. <laughs> Pathetic, is it not? I cannot save even a single child. That's what I meant. She feels bad in herself. She feels guilty. No, I understand. It would just be unhappy trapped down here. The ruins are very small once you get used to them. It would not be hard for you to grow up in a place, place like this. My expectations, my loneliness, my fear. For you, my child, I will put them aside. If you truly wish to leave the ruins, I will not stop you. However, when you leave, please do not come back. I hope you understand. Oh man, she even hugs us. Goodbye, my child. It's okay, Toril. I will, I will, I will, I will, I will get through this. I promise. I promise. This will not be our last chat. A big floor, big hallway, with every gradient of purple or yellow going, uh, yellow. Every gradient of pink is getting less saturated. Clever, very clever. You think you're really smart, don't you? In this world, it's kill or be killed. So we're able to play by your own rules. You spared the life of a single person. <laughs> I bet you feel really great. You didn't kill anybody this time. But what will you do if you meet a relentless killer? You'll die and you'll die and you'll die. Until you're tired of trying. Until you're tired of trying. What will you do then? Will you kill out of frustration? Or will you give up entirely on this world? And let me inherit the power of con uh, uh, the power to control it. I am the prince of this world's future. Don't worry, my little monarch. My plan isn't registered. This is so much more interesting. He's laughing at us. He's planning something. Or is it against us? Either way, we are finally out of the runes. And with that, out of the sort of tutorial era. Undertale by Toby Fox. Insane. Do we have time for this? No, I don't care. There's a camera hidden in the bushes. What? How? That is uh, kind of scary. That um, stick was... Okay. We're playing a horror game now. Ah, oh, yeah. We're playing a horror game. Let's go. Oh no. Guys, it's time to die. Human. Don't you know how to greet a new pal? Turn around and shake my hand. Oh no, oh no. This is going to be a new boss fight. Uh. <laughs> that would be cutting in the hand trick. It's always funny. Anyways, you're human, right? That's hilarious. I'm Sans. Sans is golden. I'm actually supposed to be on watch for humans right now. But, uh, you know, 
I don't really care about capturing anybody. Not my brother, Papyrus. He's a human hunting fanatic. Hey, actually, I think that's him over there. I have an idea. Go through this gate thingy. Yeah, go right through it. My bro made the boss too wide to stop anyone. Quick, burn a conveniently shaped lamp. Wow, that lamp is indeed conveniently shaped. Sup, bro? You know what? Sup, brother? It's been eight days and you still haven't recalibrated your puzzles. You just hang around inside your station. What are you even doing? Staring at the slam, but it's uh, really cool. Do you want to look? No, I don't have time for that. <laughs> what if Ewan comes through here? Oh man, what if? I want to be ready. I will be the one. I must be the one. I will capture human. Then I, the great Papyrus, will get all the things I utterly deserve. Respect. Recognition. I will finally be able to join the royal guard. People were asked to be my friend. I will bathe, bath in a shower of kisses every morning. Hmm. Maybe the slime will help you. Sans, you are not helping, you lazy bones. All you do is sit and boondoggle. You get lazier and lazier every day. Hey, take it easy. I've gotten a ton of work done today. A skeleton. Oh man. Sans! Come on, you're smiling. I am and I hate it. Why does someone as great as me have to do so much just to get some recognition? Well, sounds like you're really working yourself down to the bone. Oh my god. Now, I will attend to my puzzles. As for your work, put a little more backbone into it. Yeah. <laughs> Oh man, what a great dude. Heh. <laughs> okay, you can come out now. Oh, that was, that was, that was indeed a show. I gotta say. Uh, you ought to get going, you might come back. And if he does, uh, you'll have to sit through more of my hilarious jokes. Oh no. Actually, I hate to bother you, but can you do me a favor? I was thinking, my brother's been kind of down lately. He's never seen a human before, and seeing him might just make his day. Don't worry, he's not dangerous, even if he tries to be. Thanks a million, I'll be up ahead. What do you mean you'll be up ahead? You literally went the wrong direction. Okay. Uh, safe point. The convenience of that lamp still fitted with determination. Yeah, that lamp really was convenient, I gotta say. Snowden. Alright, y'all. That's it for this episode. I hope you enjoyed, and we'll see each other next time in Undertale with Sans and papyrus. See ya.